Hello there and welcome to Bassoon Boot Camp. Uh, I hope you're excited to begin your journey learning how to play um, the bassoon. Uh, so for this first lesson, you are going to need three things. You're going to need a bassoon reed. You will need your vocal. And finally, you will need just a small container uh, with water. Now your reed uh, your bassoon reed, uh, I'm going to assume you already have one, um, and if you don't, um, there are some resources down below this video to uh, help you uh, to acquire one. But <clears throat> your bassoon reed um, has a few different parts to it, uh, so I'm going to hold it up a little closer so you can see. Um, so it, it's, it has two blades, and if I turn it sideways you can see there's two blades, right? And those blades are... <clears throat> Uh, connected by uh, uh, three wires. Uh, so the first wire here, the second wire here, and then the third wire, um, which is bound here, you can't see it. Um, okay, so that's your reed. Uh, reeds are reeds are uh, pretty expensive so um, and, and very fragile, so take good care of your reeds, okay? Um, <clears throat> now your bocal, your bocal here, um, has cork on one end, um, and uh, this is what will connect your reed to your bassoon um, eventually. Uh, these are also very expensive, uh, so make sure you take good care of your vocal. Okay? All right, now we're going to take our reed and we're just going to place the whole thing into the water, and we'll take it out. And we'll shake off the excess water, and we're ready to go. Now we'll just place that uh, on a on a table or somewhere safe um, until we need it. Uh, okay, so now we have to learn how to form our embouchure. All right, so to do that, we're going to use our little finger, and what we're going to do is we're going to place that little finger right on your bottom lip, like so. Okay, once you've done that, we're going to draw the finger into the mouth, uh, thusly. And you'll notice that will cover your bottom teeth with your bottom lip. Okay? All right, so now we're going to take our top lip and we're going to slightly curl it over the top teeth. And then we'll just close our mouth um, around the, uh, the little finger. All right? And that's pretty much your bassoon embouchure. Okay, think of like a drawstring bag, right? Um, it's going to close in around from all sides equally. So we don't want necessarily like the cookie monster mouth, but more closing in from the sides. Okay. Now we're going to repeat that same process on our reed. Okay. So we're going to, we're going to find the point that's about two thirds of the way from the tip of the blade to that first wire. So two thirds would be right about here. And that's where we're going to place our lips. And there you go. Okay, now we're going to do that same thing again. We're going to take a big breath. And we're just going to blow as hard as we can, okay? So let's try it. So that's kind of the sound you're looking for. Um, if yours matches mine, more or less, uh, you're on the right track. Um, if it sounds more like this, sort of that high-pitched um, sound, that means you're squeezing, uh, or you're, you're too tight on the reed, essentially. So uh, remember the drawstring bag coming in from the sides, um, not the cookie monster coming up and down. So just try to open up, O, oh, like an O shape, O, oh, and, um, and make sure you're not putting any pressure on the reed, okay? Another sound you might hear is this. So that kind of um, almost like nasally honking sound, um, that probably means the reed is too far in your mouth um, and that your lips are uh, up to that wire there. So just bring them back to about here and that should um, take care of it, okay? So just kind of experiment with that a little bit until yours kind of matches mine 
um, as, as close as possible. Okay. Now, <clears throat> once you've done that, what you want to do is take your bocal and very carefully, always without touching the tip or the edge of the, the, the blades, very carefully just twist your reed onto the bocal. And the uh, blades should be uh, flat this way. Um, so, right, not like that, see that? Uh, but flat like that, okay? All right, so then we're gonna just do the same thing we did before, um, but this time, uh, this time with the vocal. Let's give it a go. And there you go, that's kind of the sound you're looking for, all right? So just play around with that, uh, with the reed itself, with the reed attached to the vocal, um, and just practice that a few times till you get kind of comfortable with um, how that feels, how that sounds, and, and all of that good stuff, okay? All right, uh, great job on your first lesson. I'll meet you right back here for lesson two.